People used to rely on candles, oil lamps, and gas lamps to light up their homes and streets. While these sources of light were useful, they were also dangerous. Sir Humphrey Davy, an English chemist, created the first electric arc lamp in 1802. These were an improvement, but arc lamps needed large batteries or generators and needed to be replaced after short periods of time. Later, in the 1840s, Warren de la Rue, a British scientist, developed a light bulb using a platinum filament, but platinum was too expensive for general use. Sir Hiram Maxim, an American inventor, also experimented with electric lighting, but his designs were not practical for everyday use. Finally, in 1879, American inventor Thomas Edison created the first burning light bulb. How exactly did Edison's light bulb work? There are four main parts of the light bulb. 1. The glass envelope. 2. The filament. 3. The base. 4. The gas inside the bulb. The glass envelope protects the filament and keeps oxygen out, while the filament is the part that actually produces light. The base connects the bulb to the power source and the gas inside the bulb helps make the life of the filament last longer. When an electric current passes through the filament, it heats up and starts to glow. This process is called incandescence. The filament is made of a material with high electrical resistance which allows it to heat up without burning out too quickly. The gas inside the bulb helps prevent the filament from burning out. The light bulb was one of the most amazing inventions ever made and learning about it is very interesting. Thank you for watching.